My name is Brandon, also known as the Georgia Picker, and pretty much I go sourcing at garage sales, uh, thrift stores, bin stores, storage units, online liquidation, like you guys name it, I'm trying to do it. Yo, 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 what's good everybody? It's your boy Brandon, also known as the Georgia Picker, and it is the wifey. So, <laughs> you guys, check this out. This is probably going to be probably the most hyped up bin store video you guys have ever seen. There is one brand new one that was supposed to be opening up mid-December of uh, this past year, and oh my goodness, I guess we're making money already. <laughs> um, it's supposed to open up mid-December of last year, and they just announced that they're opening tomorrow at 9 a.m. But check this out though, it is 10 o'clock at night. So their video got shared over 1,100 times, if not more than that. Uh, there's hundreds of likes on their video, and it's just kind of crazy. And from what I've seen on YouTube, people who have been to opening day to bin stores, people were literally camping out there overnight. So me and the wife, we were literally talking. We were like, let's show up at three or four o'clock in the morning. Maybe that'll be good. And then we were like, nah, nah, let's do three. And then finally we were like, let's do one o'clock. We went to bed around seven. We woke up around this time and we were like, you know what? We really need to take advantage of this situation. We need to show everybody why nobody is doing it like us. You know what I'm saying? We are gonna go out there and get ours, so that means we're gonna go ahead and get ready to go ahead and go there to camp out overnight. They open up at 9 a.m., we're gonna be there by 11-ish uh, at night, so that'll give us about 11 hours to kind of burn, but we got movies on the phone, we got all types of stuff, and look at this, the wife is already, you know, got the, she did, she got snacks, you know what I'm saying, she got drinks, and we gotta get the puppy some food before we leave too. So yeah that's what we're gonna do we're gonna show everybody that we are grinding and this is for you guys you guys motivate us to do this and we were in the military too so you know this ain't this ain't nothing to us so uh yeah so much love you guys thank you guys for tuning in to, for today's video and the puppies are surprisingly up there's piper there's max over there just gooning over there piper piper what are you doing yeah but uh yeah literally we literally made the bed we crawled right in just to wake up early this morning and we were like Let's just go ahead and go. So yeah, without further ado, let's go ahead and get there. You guys might see a few little tidbits and up until the store actually opens up. So wish us luck and we're determined to find some good stuff. By the way, before I leave, sorry, I know I'm ranting. Um, we're rambling. Their bin store is like 5,000 square feet and 150 bins. It's like the biggest one along the Southeast. Like it's kind of crazy. So, and it's local and it's about a 25, 30 minute drive from us. So. Yeah, you guys, let's get it. All right, guys, check it out. So we're actually here at Black Friday Deals. Um, it's, their, it's their bin store, it's called Black Friday Deals. It's here in Garden City. The address will be down in the description below. Um, that's the way they look right there. Uh, we are here first. We are the first in line. Keep in mind, it's also only 11.30 at night, so we have a long night ahead of us, which is fine, but we wanna show you guys that uh, we are about that life. You know, we are, we're here to get the deals first, and hopefully it'll pay off in the long run. Um, this is their grand opening, so I'm assuming there's gonna be, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say 100 people here. You know, maybe more, maybe less. I'm not sure, but at the end of the day, we're gonna find out. So, but we made it. 11:30 at night, and uh, no, I'm sorry, not even 11:30. It's 11:15. So, uh, yeah. So, uh, wish us lucky, guys. We do this. Uh, we do this for you guys. So make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, like, comment, all that good stuff, and let's hopefully we can find some good stuff. This is Black Friday deals. Uh, everybody's gonna be uh, super excited today because we have a lot of great products and everything in the store any item is only seven dollars and tomorrow it's going to be five dollars and sunday four dollars monday two dollars tuesday one dollar wednesday 50 cents we close thursdays to clean the store restock and start all over it's a cycle so it's not a one day thing or seasonal uh, store all right charlie oh. Excuse me, excuse me. And you know, we, we, we got some shopping carts here. Yes, sir. And we got the other shopping carts on the other side, okay? 88. Right. 87. 88. 88. Yeah. Hold them, I did. Go ahead. I'll go. Oh, 89. 
على راسي جو هيد جو هيد جو هيد جو هيد مو فاستر 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 Let me know and I'll okay. open it for you. And... Yes, ma'am. Will do. All right, guys. I'm going to give you guys a little bit of context in this video real quick. Hopefully, I can keep this kind of short. So, yes, it is $7 day. It is their grand opening. So, basically, they close for a day to restock all of the bins. And then on Fridays, on their opening days, uh, everything is $7. That clock, $7. A $5,000 laptop. Guess what? $7. Um, now, one thing I've actually noticed about this store is that they are very clean, very professional. Um, the environment is great as well. I actually met a couple of the owners and employees, and uh, they're just very cool people. Very happy to see you happy, and that's one thing uh, that I do like when it comes to business. Now, they kind of treat you like crap. Guess what? I'm not going to be your business person, you know, to kind of, you know, buy stuff that you have um but the fact that they are very professional fun at, you know if anything they are extremely fun people uh to be around and just talk to so that's one reason why i'm going to keep coming back here to do business uh secondly there is a little bit of everything for everybody you guys i mean we literally found a uh, space heater for my garage we found uh, a harry potter collectible for my wife because she loves harry potter stuff I mean, we find all types of stuff on this grand opening. We spent a lot of money. <laughs> Let me go ahead and tell you guys that now. We spend a lot of money here on the grand opening. So anyways, every day is like any other bin store, right? So Friday is $7 a day. The next day is, you know, five, four, three, two, one, and all the way down to 50 cent day on Wednesdays. And then they close on Thursdays and they restock on Fridays. Uh, this is the very first bin store video of this particular bin store. And we're finding all types of stuff. Look at this massager, beautiful thing. Probably goes about thirty to forty dollars, I believe. And uh, there's, there's the space garage heater right there that I see. I'm gonna throw that right there in the buggy. And then shortly after that, we find this Harry Potter collectible thing, which was uh, it was all in there, brand new, uh, crazy stuff. And I believe it goes for like thirty bucks, but we got it for seven dollars. So um, enough of me rambling and talking to you guys. You guys know how bin store videos work. If not, and you guys are new, uh, I just explained it. So um, yeah. So without further ado, man, let's go ahead and get back into the video. Looking for anything specific? Headphones. Some headphones? What kind of headphones? Just to uh, play AirPods. music? AirPods. Okay, I got you. If I see it, I get it for you. <laughs> it's crazy, isn't it? <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh, sorry. Oh, it Yeah. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. You find everything all right? Yeah. If you need me to open something or anything like that, just let me know. Okay. Hey, do they have a problem with me having my camera and stuff? No, they just wanted to know what it was. Oh, yeah. I already talked to uh, Mo. He said it was all good. Yeah, because so. they told me I actually saw ads. So I was like, is there an issue with it? It was like, no, we just wanted to know. All right, guys. So this is our our load of the buggy. Spent two ninety two eleven, uh, thirty nine items. So we will do the recap when we get home. Look how many people are out here, bro. I know. Black Friday deals, Garden City. Um, but uh, yeah, not too bad. Almost three hundred dollars, thirty nine items. So we'll show you guys the recap when we get home. All right, guys. Check it out, you guys. We are back at the house. Wow, what a rush. Um, not gonna lie, we, we, me and the wife outdid ourselves in this video. Think about it. Brand new Ben store come to, come to, uh, come to town. Uh, we were there at 10.30 last night and we were the first in line to a grand opening. What more could you want, you guys? If you guys uh, want to see us be there at first every single time, subscribe, like, comment, all that good stuff. Um, because, wow. Originally they said there was 150 bins, but I think they said it was 120 bins. Either way, 120 bins is insane. We got some crazy stuff, and I'm gonna show you guys the haul real quick. And this isn't technically everything, but I'm just gonna kinda get you guys a, a vibe of what we're looking at, you guys. Look at that. Beautiful stuff. Beautiful, 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 beautiful stuff. <laughs> so, all right. So, let's go ahead and get into how much we spent. We spent $292 and some change. Each item was $7. And I think we are going to make a killing off of this uh, this bin store. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and get into a handful of things that me and the wife got for ourselves. So there's a total of 39 items. So I'm not sure how many items we have for resale, but either way, I think we're gonna make a killing off of this off of these items. So first and foremost, got me some kind uh, kind bars. These are breakfast probiotics, sustain energy, whole grains, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So, and there's, let's see, there's eight bars per box and there's eight boxes. So that means there is 64 of these bars. So not too bad for $7. I will take that all day. And then in the bins, I did see these. These are not expired or anything like that. These are Starbucks white chocolate double shot energy beverages. Um, I, I actually don't really drink these, um, but I do love Starbucks coffee. And I've got the whole case for seven bucks. Now I wanna say at a gas station, these things are normally what? Two, three bucks, I'm not sure. So uh, yeah, we got four, three, we got 12 of those for seven bucks. So these two are for myself. A couple of things the wife got, I mean, I probably wouldn't have gotten this for seven bucks, but I mean, they're silicone protection case for her, uh, her ear pods, I guess. And then we found this little cute Harry Potter, like collectible trunk. And you guys know she collects Harry Potter stuff. This I thought this thing was really cool though. Brand new, has a bunch of little cool stuff. I think that's the uh, platform nine and three quarters. Eh, if I can get it, I don't wanna mess it up, but nine and three quarters, I guess, like train ticket, I guess. Very cool stuff though, it's seven bucks. I think that was worth it. I don't know what that would technically be worth, but uh, very cool stuff there. And then right here, um, I got a garage space heater because whenever I work in the garage, it does get cold. I think that was a, a good pickup for seven bucks. Generic brand, probably, you know, not worth crazy amounts, but for enough for me to stay warm whenever I work in the garage. 
And then all three of these are just plastic drawers for her organization stuff in the pantry and you know in the house and stuff. So that is everything that we bought for ourselves plus two sets of Legos that I bought for myself. Because as you guys know, I started up my personal Lego collection. So if I can find them in the bins for seven bucks or cheaper, I'm probably gonna get it just for my own personal collection. And as I'm talking about that, I'm working on a, uh, a set here. And then look at here, Max. Max, what's that? <laughs> hey buddy. Yeah, he's relaxing on the clothes. Yeah, he's a good boy. So yeah, also too, my wife's radiator blue. So we ended up getting uh, a lot of the parts in today and we're still waiting on one more part for the uh, 19th so got a lot of stuff to do but getting back to the task at hand we got all of this beautiful merchandise um and i think we're going to do very well so after you after you take consider uh consideration of one two three four five six seven items from the 39 items that we had minus two so that would be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we're looking at about 30 items right here that we are going to be reselling. So let's go ahead and get into it. All right, guys, so let's go ahead and get into, I guess, some of the smaller stuff. I looked up a handful of things, but I don't know everything. My wife found quite a bit of stuff too. So um, I found this multi-collagen wholesome wellness protein shake thing, powder and the expiration date is april of 2023 so got it for seven bucks it is still sealed so hopefully that brings in some good money then we got this hp 67 two pack ink and it is june of 2023 you guys know i'm infamous for picking up ink and toner and that type of stuff so pretty good find here for seven bucks i've sold one of these before at ncis 17th season as well as the 16th one um I looked this up, I want to say 30, 35 dollars, but seven bucks spent on that. All right guys, then we have this thing right here. It says 9006, it says Aoki, A-U-K-E-E, -E, uh, 9006. I want to say these are LED lights, I think. Yes, they are for, for your car. Um, if you guys ever see these, as long as the brand is, you know, if you can find that brand, these actually tend to do extremely well. Usually 30 to 40 bucks. If they have like sets of four, they will go up to, you know, 75 to like 130. Um, but these right here, I didn't look these up. Charlie actually found those. So we'll put a soul comp on that, but we got it for seven. Um, the wife looked this up. It's called Vimtag. Um, it looks, I don't know why, but maybe I could be wrong. Maybe the sell through rate is good. I'm not sure. Vimtag Wi Fi camera. Um, it looks kind of like Chinese like version of something like a like an actual um webcam because there's no real like crazy brand name or anything like that kind of a cheap box so i don't know you know seven bucks this right here i'm not sure what this is going to go for it all it says is android <laughs> so android car stereo um but the item was brand new i found this in the bins uh looks like all the cords were there but that is the brand name the brand name is android but it's not like the brand android if that makes sense this is like kind of like a third party type of uh car stereo but it is touch screen all that good stuff very cool though very good very good condition not sure what the value of that's gonna be but i figured it was gonna be more than seven dollars so the wife looked this thing up it says sign signs tech electronic touch screen door lock um the wife found this looks like everything is in there she, and i said is this worth it and she was like oh yeah so soul comp will be on the screen you guys will see that i'm not sure but uh if this uh the soul comp turns out to be good then that means the wife must have did a heck of a job on that um then we got my wife found this as well nest power connector got it for seven bucks not really sure what that's worth but it looks like it's open and i will say this though the, the quality of the stuff is pretty pretty good yeah it's still brand new open box um but yeah i think this store is going to benefit us a lot and the reasoning why is because it is uh local for us and on top of that it's like it's like 20 minutes away it's local and the fact that they're seven dollars and we're not driving out of our way to spend you know eight to ten bucks on uh you know the restocking day so it's, it's also cheaper too and logically it makes sense to come here every friday as long as we keep finding stuff like this however it doesn't mean that we're going to stop going to other bin stores but for this one it, i think it's going to benefit us uh you know pretty well so um back to it though we have this wans view camera the wife found this one too also i'm not sure about this but she says she looked it up so model q5 and it's black so 
I don't know, seven bucks. I have picked up this uh, brand in the past. Um, this is called Farin, Farin, F-A-H-R-E-N. And this one is 9,005 plus 9,006. Just for two, and these are LED lights uh, for vehicles as well. I sold a set of two for like 40 bucks. So let's see, and I believe this is a set of four. So uh, yeah, so set of four, I'm thinking maybe more than, I mean, maybe 75 bucks. I'm not sure. I'm really not, but we will make sure to put that so comp on there for you guys. But we also got that for seven dollars. Going around like the second time, we found these Avalon dual stage replacement filters. I've already uh, took a sneak peek on the inside. They are still sealed. The box is just really trashed. Um, but this thing right here is going for like eighty dollars, and it was sitting right there on top of the bins, which made no sense to me. But um, this should sell for about eighty bucks. All right, my wife found this. Um, again, I'm not sure if I would have bought this. Two reasons why. Um, is, I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm pretty sure that's probably worth some money, Javelia 84 count, but the reasoning why is because we should have got it opened, because this is not a, a normal seal, and uh, the fact that it is, it says 2020 right here, so I don't know if these are going to be expired, um, but definitely, maybe you guys get this stuff, you got to check to see if it's expired. Um, but I guess we won't know until we open it. Um, but either way, you guys will see the sole comp of what this will potentially go for. The wife says she looked it up and she said it, it, it does, it's, do, it's going pretty well. So, but I'm just hoping that all 84 K pods are in here. So we'll definitely double verify that. All right, next thing I found um, around my second time ago, uh, going around, this is a Parkside 20 volt 2AH battery and charger. You actually get this from Kohl's apparently. Um, but seven bucks, always buy batteries and chargers all the time. So not sure what the value is, but for seven bucks, I thought it was gonna be worth it. Uh, then you got this power inverter, BYGD. And this one is a 800 watt, I believe. Yeah, so DC 12 volt, 800 watt uh, power inverter. It is brand new, um, maybe 50 bucks, maybe more, maybe less. I'm not 100% sure. But again, for seven bucks, I figured why not? You cannot beat that in my opinion. And uh, let's go ahead and get into the stuff that's in the back. All right, so we got this thing. Um, this one kind of went out like on a hunch. Uh, the wife found this, it's called a Letcom. There is some sold comps and then I believe there's more listings than sold comps. But I figured from some of the stuff that we found, I was trying to find like a filler item. And I think this is pretty good. Um, comes with a remote, it is brand new um, on the inside. As you guys can see there, brand new sealed. Um, but for seven bucks, I figured it was worth it. Next thing we got is this Calphalon Classic uh, knife set. There you go, turn that bad boy around. Uh, if this thing, and I believe it's, it's actually fully like sealed, like it's glued down still. I believe this thing is brand new. Calphalon Classic full stainless steel knives. Um, got it for seven bucks and these things are going for about 150, I believe. So this right here was a heck of a find and my wife found that as well. All right, around my second time I went, there was these uh, Nespresso like set of three. Um, I honestly don't know what, I guess it's coffee, I think. Um, don't sleep on coffee stuff, you guys. Coffee stuff will sell. Yeah, this is Nespresso, Adasio, Malazio, and Stormio. I really don't know if I'm saying that correctly. Um, but it looks like these are going for about 30 for like all three like in, a, in total as like a package. Um, but for seven bucks, it's already boxed up and all that good stuff, so might as well. All right, next we have this Envo Spa Needing Massager. Uh, Shiatsu Electric Massager with Heat. Um, these always do uh, pretty well. Then you got this Rest Tech, uh, another neck and back massager. Um, but we got both of those, seven bucks a piece. And not sure what the value is on those because I've never heard of these brands before, but usually you tend to, you can't go wrong with this type of stuff. All right, guys, so... The next thing that we have is this La Rev... I don't really know how to say that word. I'm not going to even try, but it is a frozen dessert maker. Healthy living. It is brand new on the inside. We've already verified that. Not sure what the value is on this because the wife found it. So it's one thing I did not look up, but Soul Comp will be there. Again, pay $7. Uh, then you got the Secura Grind and Brew Automatic Coffee Maker. Model CM6686AT, and that's what that looks like. Brand new on the inside, I believe. I believe the, the wife verified this. Um, so not sure what the value is on that. Next thing, this thing is actually brand new. I already verified this. The wife did find it. This is a Honeywell Home RTH9585WF thermostat. And uh, I believe, Charlie said they're going for like 100. So um, very cool stuff there. Uh, some more LED lights. These are Beam Tech. H11 LED lights. Um, again, 
I, I pick up these from time to time whenever I see them, as long as they're new, all that good stuff. The wife did find these though, and they look uh, brand new on the inside. Um, but again, these things do pretty well for me. Maybe not for some, but for me, they do. Uh, this is actually very surprising. Um, the wife showed me so comps. I want to say 40 plus shipping, I think. Um, but it's actually a guitar. It's a guitar in there, but it's not like Nintendo Wii brand. But it says wireless guitar for Guitar Hero and Rock Band. Um, I'm not sure if I'm allowed to sell this on, on eBay. I mean, there are listings and, and sold comps on them everywhere. So I'm not sure, but essentially uh you guys can build your own guitar let's see let's see if it's brand new on this i will try to double verify that to make sure i can sell this on on ebay but i mean it looks good i mean you know for what it is so i guess we will we will find that out later on all right guys moving over here uh, i guess the wife found this as well lange lange l-a-n-g-e appliter straightener uh, i'm not i'm not too sure on that to be honest uh, but the wife found it, so she must have looked it up. So hopefully that's pretty good. All right, next we have this Doxy Go SE Wi-Fi Edition. No idea what this is. It says, go seriously paperless with Doxy Mobile Scanner. So this is a mobile scanner. Oh, wow, look at that. Brand new. Very cool stuff. Um, like I said, I don't know the value of this. The wife looked it up, and I, whenever she looked it up, she actually gave me the, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. <laughs> so... Hopefully that might be a $100, uh, $100 piece right there. Keep in mind, like I said, we spent $292 in total for all of this. So I'm really hoping that we are going to make a killing on our grand opening of the new Ben store that's local. It'd be great. Next thing is this Intrige. I don't, I'm probably saying that name wrong too, but it's a vacuum sealer. The wife found this model number E2902-MS. And this one is actually sealed on the inside as well. Brand new with the plastic. And uh, yeah, you guys will see the sole comp on that. Next thing we have is this Carbonator 3. I did not look on the inside to see if it is brand new, but hopefully it's brand new or open box because these things are going for 180 all the way up to $200. All right, and last but not least, the wifey found this as well. This is a Cool Master. Cool Master has some, you know, decent products, um, but this is like liquid cooling. It's called Master Liquid ML360R RGB. Um, so essentially RGB throughout the whole thing. Um, and I opened it up and it is brand new on the inside like still sealed with the plastic everything's in there um, So I mean yeah, I mean I mean <laughs> everything is brand new uh, Never used so I don't know what the value of this is but you guys either way will see the sold comp and That is everything that we got for two hundred and ninety two dollars uh, Yeah, like I said, it's kind of crazy of uh, some of the stuff that we found and we found nine items just for ourselves and think about it i mean a kind bar in the morning you know it, it kind of helps out with like grocery bills as well and you know that good stuff but but yeah 292 dollars for all of that and i think just in three to four items we're gonna make all of our money back plus some and that leaves us with a lot more inventory. So shout out to the Black Friday Deals Bin Store. They're brand new in Savannah. The address will be down in the description below if you guys ever wanna come check them out in the Savannah area. Um, I think it's gonna be a nice little spot to go to. Hopefully we can continue to be the, one of the first people there and uh, just keep grinding like we always do. Um, like I said, if you ain't first, you last. I mean, I never said that before, but um, you know, Will Ferrell uh, said that in uh, Talladega Nights. So, um, <laughs> Um, well, I guess his dad said it first technically in the movie, but still you guys understand my, what I'm saying Sometimes if you guys want to prevail in this type of business, you got to be first or second or third or fourth or fifth You know what I'm saying? You all you all the the the, the, uh, the bird the early bird gets the worm gosh <laughs> My mind is racing at a thousand a thousand miles right now But yeah, the early bird gets the worm and I think we did fairly well There's a uh, my buddy Gary. He found a, a gaming laptop that my wife was getting ready to get to but she stopped at a bin and all, and all that so uh, i'm sorry my phone's ringing i'm gonna stop that real quick but um yeah thank you guys so much for watching i love you guys stay motivated and uh yeah you guys i love you guys much love we'll see you guys next video peace i'm in the big leagues told them don't miss me balling like houston hey feeling like whitney i need a bag bro send it too quickly i'm making his dog like I'm in the big leagues, told him that I gotta go, dawg I'm riding a road, y'all, I think that I'm back in my bag now So I need that go, y'all, got hits when they throwin' the fastball